You know how the food you eat is converted into feces? This is a tasteful video. Suggest friends who are eating to roll away. When we feed food into the mouth, the sleeping liquid glands in the mouth secrete amylase to digest food. It can break down food into chewable viscous substances. Food is chewed into small pieces and mixed with sleeping liquid, immediately pushed to the esophagus by the throat. Then enter the stomach. The stomach is a muscular organ. At this point, the stomach will secrete gastric juice to help digest food. It can perform a strong stirring effect on food. With the coordination of gastric folds, the gastric acid in gastric juice has extremely strong acidity, can dissolve the vast majority of food. After about three hours of gastric digestion process, food is transported to the small intestine. The small intestine can convert and absorb various nutrients in food, and then enter the bloodstream through the small intestine wall, transported to various tissues and organs throughout the body. But there are still some undigested and absorbed residues left in the small intestine, and these residues will be sent to the large intestine. The large intestine absorbs water and electrolytes from food to make the texture of feces more solid. And the large intestine is home to a large number of beneficial bacteria. They further decompose residual food through the fermentation process, produce some sustenance and gases. Final, contractive movement through the large intestine. The feces are pushed to the rectum, preparing to defecate. Under the synergistic contraction of anal and rectal muscles, the feces are smoothly excreted from the body. It can be seen from this that the process from food entering the mouth to the formation of feces. It is a complex and delicate digestion process. Each organ plays its own role. Ensure that food is fully digested, absorption and excretion. Therefore, we should cherish and protect the health of the digestive system. Avoid junk food.